Welcome back to BDE. Today we're going to start our adventures back into our first edition of Mon. Alright, so I just figured, you know, uh, this is a box that I'd held onto. So this one I marked particularly because I bought this one at the height of height of these costs of these cases. So I paid two grand for this and at the moment they're sitting between thousand and nine hundred dollars on average um so yeah i need to pull something really amazing out of this case to make it worthwhile uh but you know that was this I only bought the one back then let me just open that top of that case opening it only did the one uh, okay so you know we live and learn you know a bit of the old, what do they say, FOMO, fear of missing out. And so I bought myself a case and I never opened it. <clears throat> but now we're going to open it. So this is two grand of my money I'm going down the drain. Unless we pull a double li Cold for library. It's never going to happen. So let's rip into it. We've lost money. Such is life. That's what it's about, having fun and not worrying about all that. Have a look at this display. So, we are now out of, um, more news. Obviously, we're now out of print with our WTR. So, I need to get a couple more cases of, ah, oh, that's just gone everywhere. We're going with a mess pile today, apparently. Another few more cases of the WTR Unlimited to put away for future openings. Because that set is beautiful to look at and will have memories for people. Even though I started mostly with this. Oh, what are we going to get, ladies and gentlemen? What do you think? Spewing Shadows, Stubby Hammers. And just a couple of rares and just a token. So I've got to try and remember we have tokens again. That's a great way of opening cards. Just rip into it. Like literally. Ooh. What's this? Barely tail, it's foiled. It's a rare foil. Almost looks like the foil pots. I keep talking and I'm not looking where I'm putting on the camera. Thanks, guys, for not telling me. I appreciate that. We can't see this. So I've got the uh, le uh, the lens flipped and I forget where the actual camera is uh, versus where I'm looking on this, where I'm looking at the camera itself. So thanks for letting me look like a complete idiot. Uh, I appreciate that, everyone. Thanks for not telling me in the comments. Uh, but it's okay. I forgive you all. I forgive you all. Warmongers. Some helmet of shadows and stuff. And we have Shadows of Blasphemy. That's the first Majestic for our pulls. Nothing exciting there. Put the token in the right spot. <clears throat> I can tell this is going to be a long video because I have no idea what I'm doing anymore. Monarch, I'm going to use the lovely crucible. Let's keep going. Uh, rift. Got a rift bind, looks pretty cool. Some dreamers. See, now I've just realized I've forgotten to put equipment into a pile. Thanks, guys. I look like an idiot in the rares. Let's get this let's get this mess under control, shall we? And so we can really pretend to be professional. There we go. There we go. Nice crisp, crisp sharp sound of opening packs. We have a soul harvest rare. It does look quite nice and foil, I must say. It's blue. Let's put that in our pile, because we're gonna just keep going with our First edition collection. We have a rare, a plow through, and a glitz. Alright. Not too fancy. 
The main reason I went back to a first edition because I kind of miss opening uh, and hunting for a cold foil. So that's why I'm doing this. Hoping I don't get hosed on my two grand box. I know I have, but <laughs> you know, better it was better to get at least one when no one knew what was going on with the the market and everything it was crazy and people like just buy it and you'll just make millions of um dollar dues and stuff like that. Herald of Rebirth, some iron plate. Uh we have an endless mall. And a nice pulping. Just opening them all over the place today, but that's part of the fun. Wait, no, that's not a double. Uh, Seek Enlightenment, Gallantry Gold. I've got two of those in cold foil, and we have the Shadows. Put that aside. Not particularly uh, happy with this box thus far. Get rid of the token first. We have Cross the Lines in blue. We have Blood Drop. We have a Glisten and Out Muscle. I don't know. I don't know. I think I should start enjoying myself a bit more. I'm just a bit gloomy on what, how much I'm not getting at the moment. But, like, don't forget, you've got to watch my videos in double speed to enjoy them. Otherwise, it's no fun. Uh, Bolt of Courage. I do like my Bolton. It's, you know, kind of sexy armor. really like it. It's a bit sexy. Uh, Seek Horizons and a... Bolting Blade in Standard 1st Edition. So that's not too bad. I'll take that as a... It's not worth that much, but I like it. Obviously, we're looking for alternate art. I have two of the same, the uh, sh whatever the shadow is. So the alternate Luminous would be just dandy right now. Move that. A Glisten in blue. Some Iron Helms, the Rise Above, the Double Rise Above. We're going to rise way above today, apparently. I don't think so. I wonder if she knows, that chick knows she's in trouble. I don't think she does. I think she's oblivious. So much dark and light. Oh, it's a red for Brandish. I think that might be something decent in coming days. It's one of the few generic attacks. It's red. We all like our generic attacks in red that cost one. So I'm going to put that in there still. But the Halo. V for the Vanguard. And we have a Prison Shield. Oh, yeah. Get rid of our tokens. We don't need them. We don't need our commons either. We're going to go in the pile. Clips. Fair foil. Very subtle. Something I'm not the biggest fan on. Some of the foil shadows are quite beautiful. Country gold. Uh, and others are just so boring. Three Majestics. And I think we're halfway. This is... This is a pack of sadness so far, and this is our top right, which seems to be the lucky one. Maybe Monarch doesn't have any luck, and it's all just downhill. Doom and gloom. I'm wasting my time opening it. The Howl from Beyond for a red, and it's a rare. Oh, into the first. Dream Weavers. A... Yeah, whatever that is, and a Battlefield. That's going all over the place. The brandish, we don't care. Captain's Call in rare foil. It's not too bad. We have a. This is not cold foil, but looks pretty nice. Nice, beautiful dress there. And we have a Valiant Thrust. 
and of course as you can all see a nourishing emptiness that's what this box is becoming it's becoming a complete another emptiness look at that she's empty you can tell she's empty this is emptiness she has hasn't eaten much to have that waste so this is the emptiness let's take this there's one of them ran away so we're gonna go open the runaway I just wish I could have played more before. Oh, there we go. We have a first Royal Majestic. And it is a Tome of Torment. You guys can let me know if that's worth it, anything, but I liked Royal Majestics in first edition. <laughs> Who doesn't, though? Who is like, no, nah, I don't want Royal Majestics, Time Skippers, and two more. So that was our first bit of halfway spice. I'd like to get at least some spice in the pack. Look how that's ripped open. What the hell happened there? Whatever. Still trying to work out all the bugs of my new office setup for my recordings. Uh, rip through reality. Looks pretty cool actually. Um, just a halo and a and a plow through. Some of you guys would let her plow you through, I'm sure. You guys are all degenerates, I bet. Band card on top. Sorry, you're banned. No one likes you anymore, band card. Piercing shadow. The four stubby hammers for the nothingness and the beacon of victory in first edition. It's a nothing burger. Only good for one hero, so that's the problem. I'm getting a bit depressed here. We're running low on packs to find even a common cold foil. Mm. Pummeling and a dust bath. We have, ladies and gentlemen, one, two, three, four, five packs left. Are we going to find anything? Probably not. We have hit Hose Town for the first box, the looks of it. I mean, if we hit a library, I'm just going to be, yep, okay, I'm done. And I uh, probably won't open the rest of the case and just use it as decorations and just have them up behind me looking all swell and stuff and we have a soul food that's actually a good hit it's not it's not a soul shield but it's still not a bad card I mean it's something you put I find like to put one in the deck because that way just for the f shits and giggles if you get it first turn uh, with Bolton you're like ooh nice I just to charge my soul, the other person doesn't get a free mulligan. Um, move along. Adrenaline rush. Memorials, and we have a dusk pass pilgrimage for our foil. Still a lot of first edition sadness coming along here. So, you know, $250 so far down the drain. Did not recover a thing yet. Rift Torment. And we have a helmet. Valiant Thrust and a Mark of the Beast. I do actually have, that's what I was talking about before. I have two of the full art, um, extended art, Mark of the Beasts floating around in my collection. I need the one. So, anyone wants to trade one for the uh, Illuminous, let me know. I could do a one for one. Don't know if that's got the same value, I just... Brandish. <clears throat> Excuse me. A Brandish. He's definitely brandishing. Pointed at you guys. See? You guys. He's gonna come at you guys. Anyway, sorry. Foil. Legs. Leg day. And we have rise above and another pull through. Last pack, no cold foil, sorry guys. 
guess Monarch doesn't follow. Only Unlimited follows the top right packs being the best. Oh, there we go. We got our cold foil in the last hit. I actually don't have Stubby Hammer, so why, you know, now I have the meme card itself in cold foil. Not a bad hit for the last pack. Happy with that. And see, do we get anything else? Normal boots. And we have just two more rares. Alright, for those who want to have a quick look at what we got, we got a Mark of the Beast, Soul Food, Beacon of Victory, a Foil Tome of Torment, that's probably one of the better ones, a uh, Nourishing Emptiness, that's also good for our Warriors, uh, not uh, Bolton, but um, for Dory, and Bolting Blade, not too bad, Shadow, and Shadow. So, not the end of the world, I got my cold foil at the last moment and that's all that matters when you're opening first edition so you get at least one uh so i'm going to be here going with the case uh since i didn't get a library all right check back in about two days for the next video uh of the next box for this case all right that's all we got time for here we'll catch you all next time here at b d d d e